Hey, we're just gonna go over this Silverado retrofit kit that we have. Um, it fits uh, the 14 plus Silverados. As long as you have these headlights with the projectors, it's gonna be able to go in. Uh, just double check, it does not fit the reflector models. So on the right here, we have the original halogen projector. It's a single, you know, single, single beam. So just low beam only. You can see it's got that, that, uh, that dimpled lens. And uh, the performance isn't that great. We're gonna show you in a second. You can throw an LED kit in there. You can throw an HID system in there. And we're gonna go over the benefits of this system. And here we got the G5R. The other G5 series are available as well. You can also use the Morimoto D2S 5.0. The brackets are right next to it. They're not pre-installed. This is how they come. So they come pre-installed with the hardware, but we're not showing them on the projector because they actually mount in the housing first. So just to show you the front side, you can see this whole system uh, carries a nice factory look. It's, it's perfectly centered. And uh, we're gonna show you how, how that all is put together. So this is the installed G5R by Xenon projector. Everything is plug and play with our system. The by is gonna hook up with the included splitters. This uses a D2H bulb. You can use a D2S bulb, but it is a lot more difficult. So the brackets actually mount first and then the projector slips right on and it comes with those locking nuts. And, you know, honestly, the first side might take you, you know, 45 minutes to an hour, but second one goes nice and easily once you know exactly what to do. Um, we've got everything connected with the H11 input. It's going to feed out and it's going to plug into a Hilux ballast. You can use other ballasts, but this setup is meant to be plug and play. The only thing that's not shown here that's going to be mounted on the vehicle is the Hilux ballast. So it's going to come out, go into the Hilux ballast, loop right back into these amp inputs going into the headlight. So back of the headlight, 100% factory. We've got this one open to show you how it all how it all is installed. So believe it or not, that projector does slip out out of that large opening. And um, we're gonna show you the output now. So the benefit of the HID system, it's warming up right now. So it's gonna take uh, maybe 10 seconds or so. You can see the, the top is the original and that's the original Vallejo uh, Silverado projector. It's halogen. Um, it's very centralized as far as the hotspot. Off to the sides, you really have you know, pretty poor performance. The HID system does give you that advantage and it gives you a much larger spread of light. So it's much more usable on top of that, which we're not gonna show you right now, it's by Xenon. So projector turns it to high beam and the original halogen high beam still works. In this case, we have an LED system installed. So kind of the best of both worlds. Uh, the setup does require you to remove the assemblies to install this projector, unlike an HID system, but if you can get around the extra hour, hour and a half of work, uh, this is totally worth it. We have this on our website and it's literally the best system, uh, you know, to, to install inside the headlights, being that there's minimal, you know, work involved. As long as you want to open up the headlights, do anything custom, this is the way we recommend. So if you guys have any questions, email us. It's info at lightworks.net. Check out this, web, uh, this product on our website under the application specific hits. Thank you very much.